Not a lot of folks get their own heads named after their snappy little car. Roxy's in the house. Emily Reeves joined the Freak Nation. What's up, y'all? Who's that over there? <laughs> That's my handsome husband. He just he just hangs out, drinks beer while we while we make videos. And on, do you do you realize that uh, I put down my beer to do this interview? <laughs> Why'd you do a silly thing like that? It kind of blows, doesn't it? Yeah. But I'm you're special. Smart. Thanks. Right? But I saw Roxy over here. I thought let's talk. Yeah, let's talk is. about Roxy. She's pretty good. Yeah, these valve covers. I'm obsessed with. All right. A dude out of Australia, Swift Tech Engineering, built me these valve covers and surprised right. me with them. And they're so special. They say Roxy GTO on them. Did you know that this was my first car mm. when I was 18? I did because I've followed you for a, a month and a half. Yeah. Oh, that long, huh? So, but the idea when you're at that age is to get rid of your car and, and take it up a notch. Did you know at that Why moment? Why would I that, do a silly thing like that? Because I had a 74 Gremlin. And you regret selling it, don't you? I actually that would do. would be a cool car to have these with, with days. A, with a 7.5-year-old, I'd rather, I'd love to put my 7.5-year-old in the front seat of a 74 right. Gremlin. Yeah, 60s on the front and 50s on the back. That would be cool. And it was tech, had a big Texas orange stripe down the side, white car with big old house speakers in the... Anyway, this is about you, sorry. <laughs> and I had soccer on the license plate. Like custom audio work, that's interesting. Look, that's just what we did in Carrollton. That's it. We drove funky cars like that. Why did you not try and get rid of Roxy at the time? Did you know that she was going to be a, so, a lifer? Whenever I found Roxy, I realized this is my dream car, and I'm going to overextend myself. Aaron and I, we were kids, but we were really like, I don't know. We had some forethought. We thought we're going to buy something early on and then love it for a long time. So we you went didn't. in No, debt. you didn't. We went it's... in debt very young and we paid it off. And now it's been paid off for like 10 years and here we are. You were, you actually had that, that forethought at that age? To, yeah. That, we were really smart. That Aaron would be, be sitting over there on boxes. I, we'd really be sitting smart. on the, the hood Maybe of your car in know. freaking Indianapolis talking about a car mm -hmm. that you've paid off 10 years ago. Yeah. That's right. why we can buy car parts, because <laughs> she's paid off. <laughs> Would it take anything for you to sell this car, or is this some? Wow, I wish, some, I whoa, what, a, what a face. Man, her. What kind of crazy talk is that? Is if it, I sold Roxy, you know how many people would be upset with me? I mean, I would never just personally, but this car is so special to me. I'm going to be a 90-year-old lady at car shows, and I'm going to be like, I've built this motor 16,000 times. You should see me drag race. Here's a video. My grandma told me about this car. Yeah. Whoa. Emily looks much younger in person at 92 years old. I'm going to be spry. I'm going to be spry. Are you hot? I'm very hot. <laughs> Listen, when we, when we first talked to you guys, we were in Phoenix. You guys were on the snappy freaking lake somewhere in mm -hmm. we took a Arkansas. Break. We took a break right. from being on the water to talk with y'all right. because we love you. I just don't. Listen, well, I'm born and raised in Dallas. I spent 28 years in the humidity. And I don't know how in the hell I did it. It's just something that you put up with, right? Yeah. Get used to it. It's character building. All right. Kind of like this car. Yeah. Much, builds character. How much money have you put in this car? Is that is that uh, out there on YouTube? Uh, no, because honestly, I hustle and make videos so that I don't really have to pay for car parts. Right. I hustle and make videos so that I don't really have to pay for car parts. Right. I mean, if we're looking at how much my time is worth, probably a lot because I spend hours and hours and hours and hours editing and yep. creating content around what we do. Nowadays, mm -hmm. we don't buy car parts. We, we work with companies that have marketing dollars mm -hmm. and they need to sell car parts, right? And I love the parts that they have. Take the supercharger, for instance, it's one of my favorite pieces on this car and I wanted one for years. And now Roxy's boosted and it's a game changer and I love it. And it's really, really awesome and I'm very grateful. Is that a javelin on your shirt? What is that? What yeah, no, this is- <laughs> What is that? This is a Freiburger's Dodge Dart. I'm sorry, I don't see if this, it looks like a, a javelin. I mean, I'm an AMC. AMC hound from Gremlin and this is okay, sorry. This is one of Freiburger's cars. Screwed that up. Oh, it is. Yeah. No. Good old BF. Who cares about Freiburger? It's all about Roxy right now, right? I care about him. He's an old turk bird, but I love him. We say bye. Later, y'all.